Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. I don't know if Alex has started it yet because I have been at work all morning and I just finished my workout after work and now I'm heading home. Normally on Saturdays I have a private lesson after I do my workout, but she's not feeling well today so she, uh, she texted me saying that she's a little bit sick so we're gonna postpone it to do it next week probably. So now I'm on my way back over to Alex's and today is gonna be an exciting day because we're actually gonna go swing by the grocery store, pick up a few things, and then we're heading over to my house because today we're having Easter dinner with my parents and all my brothers and sisters and my, and my little nephew Brody. So that's gonna be really fun. Somebody I noticed in the comment section asked if Brody was Patricia, my other sister's son, and no, it is not. It is Val, my older sister's son. My younger sister is only 18, so she doesn't have a kid yet. But my older sister is even older than me. She's the oldest one out of the four of us, so she's the one who has the kid. And she's got a second one on the way, due in the summer. So that's going to be really exciting. But uh, I slept really good last night. Went to bed at a reasonable hour. I mean, considering I wake up at 5 a.m., I have to I have to go to bed pretty early to get a reasonable sleep. But I did last night. I was able to finish editing the video, upload it, do all that stuff. Spend a little bit of time with Alex before going to bed. It's uh, still a little bit snowy outside today, and it's been hovering right around the freezing range, like zero degrees, one minus one for the last few days. But apparently today it's supposed to go up to five degrees. Celsius and then tomorrow on Sunday is supposed to go up to plus 14 so if that's true then all this snow that we got over the last few days in the snowstorm will be melted so you know I kind of had my hopes up for an early spring but now that we got this other snowstorm I'm, I'm you know I'm realizing it's the same as every year like it snows it always warms up a bit and then we get excited and then it snows and then we get winter again so we will have to wait for spring maybe it'll be soon maybe not but it's at least not minus 25. <laughs> it's like minus two, minus three, so it's not that bad. Anyways, I'm almost getting to Alex's house now, so when I get there, I'll continue the video with her, what we're doing the rest of the day. But I just wanted to say good morning and welcome to the video because I'm not sure if she's filmed anything yet today. Good morning, guys. I'm all ready to go. And here's my new hair. You can finally see it. It's super dry and dead because I just got it dyed. But I'm obsessed. I love it. The ombre starts like here-ish. She just did like some streaks. I don't know if you can see. And I love the way it turned out. It's so white and pretty. Oh, Fabio. <laughs> now it actually looks like what it looks like in my pictures. So I don't have to do that stupid filter. Not that it's stupid. It just like it was annoying. <laughs> Yay! Let me know in the comments down below if you love it as well. By the way, my mom told me this is not a pimple on my eye, it's a sty. So I didn't put any makeup on it, I just put it around it and I tried to avoid mascara going in that direction. Um, but you're not allowed to pop it, you have to let it go away on its own. My eyebrows are kind of crazy today. Yeah, actually they're really bad. <laughs> I need to fix that oh my god we are heading out soon to get some easter treats oh my god i literally can't talk because he's so annoying <laughs> there must be someone outside yeah the neighbors are outside wow. they're playing this is frustrating anyways this is what i'm wearing very comfy and casual just a flannel that's super big with my nike leggings that i wore yesterday and some socks look how i'm like standing <laughs> when we leave later yeah i want to try to film the bank Oh, yeah, there was like a robbery last night at the bank. It looks intense. And it looked like someone blew up the side of the building, like there's a huge hole. Like literally it looks like a bomb went off that someone blew up the side and then went in. But uh, yeah, I was gonna like do my hair, like maybe curl it or something, but I don't want to put any heat on it just because if it's so like, ugh, like from the bleach and stuff. It always feels like this as soon as I dye it. After a few washes, it'll be fine. And I'm gonna be using this, the thing that I have from uh, East Salon, you know, the, the purple stuff to help. Oh my God, I, I can't film anymore. <laughs> so a little bit of a mix up this morning, guys. We made it to my house. We went to the grocery store, we picked up everything and I was gonna show you guys what we bought. And I still will when we get back to my house, but we had to come back here to Alex's because she made a little mistake by accident. She uploaded her collab video on the wrong day. So it ended up going up on the wrong day. So she had to delete it and she's going to re-upload re it. But I don't know if I'll be able to. That's what I'm stressing about because... Because of your license? So lately I've been purchasing licenses to use um, songs in my videos so I can use the full song. Um, and so I bought one, but it said I can only use it one time. So I'm like really hoping that it didn't, that I could still upload and it could still work and then I don't get copyrighted. So fingers crossed for that. So I'm currently uploading, it says four minutes remaining. So hopefully all goes well. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. This is my struggle. So I upload every Saturday at 10 a.m. It's always what I do. So every time I upload a video, um, 
I put it as a scheduled upload for Saturday at 10 a.m. Amelia, since she's in London, uploads um, later, but it actually equals 9 a.m. my time. So she uploads on Sundays normally, so we decide to do on Sunday, but when I was uploading this past week, I just, like, it slipped my mind because I'm so used to, like, out of habit just uploading on Sunday at 10. So she texted me at, like, 11, and she was like, oh my god, your video's up. Like, weren't we uploading on Sunday? I was like, oh crap! So I, like, made it private, and now I'm trying to, like, re-upload and seeing if it works. I don't know. I'm kind of stressed about it. <laughs> So guys, that is what the bank looks like. Okay, this car is now blocking it. Move, car. <laughs> well, all these cars are gonna block it, so I'm gonna try to go higher. Anyways, that's what it looks like. It literally looks like someone used a very, very small explosive to get inside the bank and blow up the wall. And I would assume steal stuff, or it was a car that crashed into it, but it looks like it's protruding out, which makes me think that it like it almost looks like something came from the inside and blew up outside. That doesn't make sense. I know. It so, looks like it's going in from my angle. I don't know. Anyways, it's pretty cool because stuff like this doesn't happen that often. And then you can see over here there's police checking it out. And they. I don't think it's pretty cool. They got the whole area roped off. Well, it, it happened in the middle of the night, so I really doubt anyone got hurt because no one works at the bank in the middle of the night. So I highly doubt someone got hurt. It's just... Interesting, there's a bank robbery. So I just wanted to add this little clip in here because I'm editing yesterday's video and I wanted to clarify that it was not a bank robbery, it was actually just a car accident. Someone actually had a seizure while driving and crashed into the bank. So I'm gonna put a little link to the news article that I read about it right here. You guys can check it out. Not as exciting as a bank robbery, but luckily nobody was hurt, the person was okay. So you can check it out here on the little news article if you want to see. It's going to be in the little corner right here. But I just wanted to clarify that a little bit. The only other time that I can remember a bank robbery, I mean, I don't even know if it is a bank robbery. I'm just assuming that's what it is. But the only other time I've seen a bank robbery here near where we live was a few years ago, there was actually a, a bomb threat scare. Yeah, see, it goes out. Yeah, it does go out. Well, anyways, I don't know. Well, maybe they'll tell us People in the news. keep going to ask questions. Yeah, they might tell us in the news. Yeah, a long time ago, there was a bomb threat scare near City Hall at one of the cities here and so all the cops obviously all the cops and fire trucks and ambulances and everything like swarmed this parking lot because someone had claimed there was like a um a duffel bag under a car with a bomb it was at rainy yeah it was like near the high school we went to actually and so all the cops and everybody was there protecting it and trying to stop it obviously but it was a fake and it was a trick and then at the same time as that a bank got robbed like 15 minutes away from there and there were no cops to deal with it like the bank probably had an alarm or called the cops or something and there was no one available to deal with it because they were all at the bomb threat and people were saying that it was the same people who put the bag there and then called and said there was a bomb anonymously they just lured them yeah like just to get all the cops busy and then they went and robbed the bank and it was actually they, they I remember they got away with a lot of money and I don't think they ever caught anyone who did it that was like the only time there's been a bank robbery around here normally there's nothing big like that this is the best chocolate in the world. Is that a Cadbury cream egg? No, it's dairy milk. So I'm still in my workout clothes and we just went for a nice long hour walk with my parents and my sister and it felt really good because it's super nice out today. It's like perfect temperature, not too cold, not too warm, it's sunny. So a really nice walk and that's why I stayed in my workout clothes because I was like, I'm gonna sweat anyway, so no point in changing. But now I'm gonna have some lunch and I'm having some general tao chicken and pineapple chicken with some chicken fried rice. Really tasty, it's from that nice uh, salad place, Eat Chez Vu, in a little food court near where we live. It's funny, we call it a salad place, but it sells a lot more than just salad, as you can see. But I'm gonna have some lunch, and then I'm gonna go take a shower. Hi. Big caca. Are you sleeping? No. Are you almost sleeping? I was before. Oh, were you actually? Mm -hmm. Oh, you paused it. No, the episode just finished. Oh, the episode finished? You wanna put on another one? Let's do episode 12. Okay guys, these candies are the best freaking candies in the entire world. They don't even have a name. I call them bonbons. Hold on, let's see if it'll focus here. They're so good, these candies, it's crazy. Like, I don't even know how to describe it. It's really chewy at first, but then as you start going, it gets easier and easier, but it's so sweet and the flavor like grows on you. Oh my God, I think I showed it in a vlog a while ago, but it's so freaking good. So now everyone finally got to my house, but I still need to shower and then I actually need to get my laundry started. So I'm gonna do that, then I'll go downstairs and I'll start filming everybody. I'm gonna play with my nephew Brody and there's a cool little present my parents got for him that I want to show you guys. It's really fun. And then we're going to have dinner and just hang out and have fun this afternoon. I'm excited. It's going to be a good time. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. 
What you doing? Go, 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 go. You want to go upstairs or downstairs? Where do you want to go? You just want to go back and forth, eh? Uh oh. He likes the blender, huh? Yeah, he wants to watch it. <laughs> yeah. Ready? Oh. Go. Brody, watch. Uh oh. Whoa. Come. <laughs> he got bored, eh? Is it the pie crust? Yeah. Mo. You want to try to score? Get it! Up! Yeah! Nice job! Those are easy ones. Yeah, you missed. <laughs> Get it, Brody! Up! You can do it! Yes! Yay! Come catch! Way to go, dude! Arms up! Arms up! Arms up! Arms up! Got nice got catch. Uh, he wiped his nose on the ball. <laughs> Up. Yay. Good job, dude. Oops, I missed. Go. Up. Missed. Get it. Oh, God. Tim's got it. Again. One, two, three. Oh, that's. You gotta go up. Yeah. Sleeves. What's up with his sleeves? Captain Adorable. I love that sleeves. You got it. Go. Oh. Yeah. Getting better at that, eh? <laughs> Get it. Yeah. Nice job. What's over here? You want to use the pink ball? Wow. Look how good she is. Look at all her winter melons. Oh, it's your pro at plants for zombies. <laughs> I'm like zoomed in right on your screen. Making fun of me. This is the end, so it's super easy you now. Yeah. yeah, but look at your defense. It's crazy. Well, I had a lot of power ups. It's perfect. Kill those last two. Got it. Nice job. Thanks. What are you doing? Uh oh. Gotta go get it. Where do you want to do the music? Nice song. Nice. Where are you going next? What's next? Back in here? You want to go look up there? Hello. Let's go look. Here, you want a puppet? Here, it's a bunny. It's a bunny puppet. Hi, Brody. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you know it's my hand, don't you? <laughs> I can't trick you. Oh, Brody's got the puppet now. It's a rabbit. No, you can't climb. No. Sorry, dude. Yeah, you can go in there. Go. Ready? Get your feet on the floor. Trish, did you make this thing too in the middle of the table? Look how cute it is. Look at the cute decorations my sister made. Look at this. Ooh. Do they open, Trish? What? Oh, they're glued. Never mind. What? Don't break her thing. No, no. I thought maybe you could open the eggs. And she made this too up there. Here, I'll start from the beginning. It says, Happy <laughs> Easter. In case y'all can't read. Reading 101 with Dan. Alex keeps physically hitting me. Because you whipped something at my face. Yeah, because you started it. No. You I started it with you. You started it. Careful, you're going to break something. You're going to break one of the cats. Look at the cats. 
Dan just took this, up, picked this up and pretended to stab me with it. <laughs> That's what Brody used to look like. He's so cute. And that's Brody a little bit later. Look, that was during my sister's wedding. And look at me, look at how long my hair was. You look like Paul Rudd. My hair was so long back then. <laughs> look at that yummy dinner. So what do we have? 24 hour salad. That's Val's quiche. Yeah, salmon. Ooh, that's gonna be so good. Some beans. A quiche my mom made. What's in it, mom? Spinach. Spinach, red pepper. Ham, cheese. eggs, cheese. Mm. It's called a Mediterranean pie. Yum. Some ham, asparagus, and Some scallop potatoes. potatoes. You get it all by yourself, Brody? Sometimes you can. Like oh. he gives up and just uses his finger. You missed. <laughs> mm. Look at how big my piece of ham is. It's thick. It's massive. Mm. And put some salt on that asparagus. Oh, for me? Okay. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> Put his hand down, Val. Shh. Mommy doesn't like them. <laughs> try it, Brody. Mmm. Thank you. Well, he's, not, he's not gonna try don't it. Don't you put it in your mouth? Don't you, you put it in? For you? I don't even know what this tastes like. It's for you. Yum. Mm. 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 Put your finger in it. <laughs> you want any more wine? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 It's so real. Oh! <laughs> Not so sure. <laughs> she tastes like vinegar. You want to put this back? I love like pickles. Oh, it's juicing. Sometimes, sometimes when I'm Is he going to try it again? Eat, I'll eat pickles. Oh! Look at this beautiful cake that my mom made. She's a master cake maker. Oh, it's a bunny for Easter, and she made some gluten-free brownies. So Alex can eat some, and then we have a whole bunch of candy over here. <laughs> These are the best. These are my favorite. Actually, after the blue candy, because I said those are my favorite. So these are my second favorite. I just like dessert. What's up, guys? We just got back to Alex's house, and we came back here to sleep, because tomorrow morning we're going for breakfast with her entire family to celebrate Easter with her family. Well, my dad's side. Yeah, her dad's side of the family, so. My mom's was tonight, but we were. But we were at my house instead. And I hope you guys enjoyed the little Easter celebration we did at my house. Brody was super cute, and he loved his new present from my mom, the basketball net. He loves to play with balls, and he always says, up. So my mom was like, oh, well, let's get him a net so we can play up ball. And then we found out today that Sean, my brother-in-law, actually said that Brody loves watching basketball on TV. And it's just a coincidence. Aww. Says like he loves just watching it in the morning when they watch Sports Center and stuff. So it was That's really cute. That's so cute. Imagine he grows up to be like a basketball player. <laughs> Maybe he'll be a professional basketball player. I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any of the videos. Alex's nice silver hair. What I want you guys to do today is make sure that you end the day on a positive note. So even if you're really, really angry or upset or a little bit stressed or something, Try to go to sleep on a positive note. So like write something down positive that happened today. Think of a memory that happened positive today. Or watch something funny. Watch something funny. Maybe this video is gonna end your day and it's gonna be positive for you, but think about something that makes you positive and makes you happy. And it's always good to go to sleep happy instead of upset because then it'll sort of help with a fresh start the next day. So I want you guys to try to do that. If this video is the start of your day, then I hope you have a wonderful day. If this is the end of your day, then I hope you already had a wonderful day and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.